I'm the right Joe. She's got ox. Okay. So let's go and take a look at this one, guys. And again, when you see the negative, you have your left hand, and the positive, you have your right hand, right? Just think of left and right hand limits. Um, and then also remember the other thing is your, for the limit to exist, the general limit to exist, we have to approach from the left hand and the right hand, right? So the limit of j of x, this is the name of this function, j of x, looks kind of confusing, but it's just all one function. The limit as x approaches negative 2, so here's negative 2, that would be 3. So as we're approaching negative 2 from the left, so as we're approaching from the left, we are going to, we are approaching positive, positive infinity. As we approach 2, that means from the left and the right, we are approaching positive infinity. But that's just 2. If that's negative 2. That you just... You're right. That was supposed to be a negative 2. I just forgot that. Thank you. But does that kind of make sense? Does everybody see that? Okay. Now let's so go and look at 3. So as we approach 3 from the right, so 3 from the right, right, right hand, and as we get really, really close to 3, we're going to negative infinity. Or now, as we're getting closer and closer to 3, we're approaching, yeah, we're going in opposite directions, right? So it does not exist. Okay. 